Hey our friends, today we're gonna to be drawing a cartoon Spider-Man! Alright, Chucker, did you get your marker? Yeah! Alright, I hope you guys are gonna follow along with us. You have something to draw with and some paper in front of you. Today is Monday, so be sure to check artforkidshub.com for the Show Your Art slideshow. Yes. We put it right on our homepage. And if you want to send your art to us to be featured next Monday, what's our email address? Myart at artforkidshub. <laughs> yes, myart at artforkidshub. <laughs> be sure to have a parent take a photo of your drawing, send one photo to us to that email address, and then we'll feature you in our next slideshow on our homepage. Yes! You ready to draw Spider-Man? Yeah. Let's do it. For this project, you're also gonna need colored pencils because we're yes. gonna color Spider-Man at the end. We're gonna use a dark blue, light blue, light red, and a dark red. We'll put those off to the side and we're gonna use our markers first. We're gonna draw a cartoon version of Spider-Man, so we're gonna yeah. try and keep it nice and easy. We're gonna first start with his head, and we're gonna draw an upside down egg shape. Okay. All right, so we're gonna start down here, well, right in the middle, and we're gonna draw it upside down so that we have, down at the bottom, uh, a shape that looks like his chin. So I'm gonna draw an upside down egg. So down here, it's kinda has a point for his chin, and then it's big and round up here at the top for his we'll forehead. There. Yeah, that's a good spot. Let's see, you're gonna start by the top of the head, Right here, we'll just draw his head right in the middle of the paper. Yeah, and then down here at the bottom, you can have his chin. So it's a little pointier. And up at the top, round. That's skinny. Yeah, he's gonna have a skinny head, that's okay. The top, round. Yeah! Just like that. Good job! Yeah, it's kinda has a flat head. That's alright. It's totally cool. No mistakes, right? Yeah. What's the most important thing? To have fun. Yes, to have fun and to practice. All right, let's draw his eyes. Okay. So right in the middle of, well, towards the bottom, but in the middle of his head, he's gonna be looking off to the left. We're gonna put two dots. And they're not, they're close together, but not too close. And that's because we wanna leave a space where his nose would be. Yeah, that's, that's perfect. Now here we're gonna draw, for one eye, we're gonna draw a football shape because he's Spider-Man, he has bug eyes. Yeah, and this can maybe come closer to the edge of his head. There we go. And then the bottom, bottom of his eye, it looks like a football, American football. Good, now on this side, we're gonna draw another eye, but it's gonna be squashed because it's on the side of his head. So we're gonna draw it, come up and touch the side, and then down here at the bottom, Bottom of his eye, oop, and I went outside. That's okay. Good, we got his face. He looks like an alien, doesn't he? Yes. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna fast forward, but we're gonna thicken up his eyes, but we wanna make sure we leave a gap in between his eyes for his, for his mask. All right, we got the thicker line going around his eyes. Now you ready for the spider web? Yeah. And his mask. In the middle, right in between his eyes, we're going to draw an A shape. We're going to draw the center of his mask, and then the spider web is going to go out from that. And then below it, we're going to do a V shape to connect one side to the other. Looks like he's got a little teeny diamond nose. Yes. Now we're going to draw the first part of the spider web going over his forehead. It's going to go in between his eyes and then curve over the top of his head. So we'll go up and then curve over. And that makes his head look round. Now we're gonna draw two more webs coming out. This one's gonna go over this eye and see how we're still curving it. Yeah, good. And then one more over this side. This side is gonna come up over his eye and then just barely curve. He looks angry. Good. Now we're going to draw two going down. One, two. We're going to draw one going over his cheek on this side, and then another one on this side of his cheek. Now that we got those lines, let's draw the other part of his web. Okay. So we're going to draw the first, and they're kind of U-shapes that connect each other. So right in between his eyes. Then we're going to draw one right here just over his eye. 
and then we're going to connect to the middle of his forehead and over to the other one and then down to his eye. Good job. Now we're going to draw the last one on top of his head. It's going to curve over to the middle and then down to the next one. And then we're going to curve down to his eye. Now let's draw the ones over his mouth. So we're going to draw one right under his eye and it's going to connect to the next one, over to the next one, until we get all the way over to this eye. We did his face. Now we're going to draw his body, okay. his arms. And let's start with his shoulder. We're going to start with a V shape right here. We're going to start with a V. That's for his shoulder muscle. And then we're going to curve up and connect to his cheek. Now we're going to draw his arm. So this is his shoulder and the arm is going to come out under his shoulder. And we're going to draw the outside of his arm. Good. Now let's draw his fist. So we're going to connect one side to the other like that. And I'm leaving a little gap for his thumb. And then we'll draw a C shape for his thumb. Cool, now halfway up his arm, we're gonna draw a contour line, a curved line. See how that makes his arm look round. Now let's draw the spider webs. We're gonna draw three lines down. One, two, three. Then we're gonna draw the webs that connect in between those lines. That, so you just draw U shapes, and then I'm gonna draw one more below that one. And we did it, good job. Now let's draw the spider webs on his shoulder. So draw one curve this way. And then we'll draw another curve going the other way. And then we're gonna connect them by drawing lines upside down U shapes. And then I'm going to draw a couple more up here. And if we go too fast, what can our art friends do? Pause the video. Yes, you guys can always pause the video if we're going too fast and you need extra time to catch up. Now let's draw his other hand over here. And this will be coming out the side of his head. So one, arm, one line for his arm and then another line for the other side of his arm. And then we're going to connect it. Then let's draw his fingers. Okay. We'll draw a little thumb sticking out. <laughs> then we're going to draw his other fingers sticking out, and they're just U shapes. I'm going to draw three fingers. Are you having fun? Yeah. Good. Now we're going to draw the spider webs. So we're going to draw two lines coming back. Now we're going to draw the cross webs. Now on each of his fingers, I'm going to do another spider web on each of his fingers. Now let's draw his body. We're going to draw a little curve right here for his chest. And then we're going to draw a curve coming out over his shoulder and then down. Good. Now we're going to draw an upside down U that connects to his arm. Now we're going to draw his belt line. It's a little curve to make his body look round. And we can draw little spider webs. Next, let's draw his legs. We'll draw the first one coming out in front of him like he's kicking. We're going to draw a line coming up under his chin and then it's going to bend down. Good. And then we'll draw the top of his foot. Then we're going to draw the bottom of his foot and it's going to curve the other direction. And this is going to be down to where his heel is. Good. And then we're going to come up. And then into his arm. 
Now, the bottom of his feet, so his legs are blue, but the bottom of his feet have spider webs on them. So it will draw a contour line on that part. We'll also draw a contour line on his foot. And then let's draw the spider webs. So let's draw three lines. One, two, three. And then we can draw the cross webs. And watch this, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna draw the U's so that they curve kind of like the top of his boot. You see that? So I'm gonna curve like this and then curve down. So I kind of make a C shape, backwards C shape that matches the top of his boot. Yes, just like that. And curve down, there you go. What's he missing? Uh, his other leg. Yeah, he's missing this leg over here. We're gonna draw a leg coming down. We're gonna draw the top of his leg that comes down to his knee. And then we're gonna draw his muscle or the bottom part of his leg. And then we gotta draw his foot. Curve coming this way. And then back up. Now we need to draw his spiderweb shoe over on this side. Okay. So we'll draw a curve going this direction so it looks like his foot's going back. And then we'll draw two lines going down his shoe. Then we're gonna draw one coming up his foot. And then let's draw the webs going across. So we'll draw little U shapes going down and connecting and then also on his foot. All right, now what is he missing? The spider stain on his back. Yeah, the spider symbol on his costume. So let's draw a curve going down his back and then color it in. And then we'll draw the little spider legs, little lines coming out from the center circle or the body of the spider. Checkers, good job on drawing Spider-Man. Yeah. He's gonna look even better once we color him. You got yes. your colored pencils? And we have our dark blue or light blue, light red, and our dark red. And we're gonna use the darker colors to do the shading. Kay. Okay, so first, let's get our red, and we're gonna color in, we're gonna do a circle. So uh, watch this, we're gonna color, I'm gonna draw a, a little curve like this, so we're gonna come through his eye and we're gonna finish that circle down here at the bottom. That cool? Then the inside of this, we're gonna color with the light red. Okay. And the outside, we're gonna color with the dark red. Okay. We're gonna do the same thing on his shoulder. We're gonna put a circle right here. And that's gonna be light red. And then we're gonna draw a little curve right here. And the left side is gonna be red light red, and then the right side is gonna be dark red. And then let's do a little curve here on his shoe. And then also on his arm right here, we're gonna do a U shape. So we're gonna color inside here, 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 in the middle of his face and on his shoulder, bright red, and the rest is gonna be dark red. Okay. You ready to fast forward? Yeah. Let's do it right now. Good job, dude. Now we're gonna switch to our light blue. And we're gonna draw, so right here where we had that line on his boot for the light red, we're gonna continue that line up onto his knee. So a little curve like that. And on the left side is gonna be light blue, this side's gonna be dark blue. Then we're gonna draw another line right here and it's gonna continue into his glove. So right where we had that line separating, the two reds, we're gonna continue that with the blue. And then over here, we're also gonna add another highlight. It's gonna be right here on the top of his leg. We'll draw a little oval shape like that. And inside is gonna be light blue and dark blue on the other. You ready to fast forward again? Yeah. Let's do it right, right now. now. We finished our Spider-Man. Did you have fun? Yeah. You did a great job. He looks amazing. 
Amazing Spider-Man. Yay! <laughs> the last step that we did was we went around with our Sharpie and we thickened the outside line so he looks like he's popping right off the page. Now we're gonna leave him just like this, but you guys at home, I wanna challenge you to finish your backgrounds. You could draw a spider web shooting out of his wrist, or you yeah. could even draw the, the city, the buildings in the background, and fill in the whole paper. We hope you had a lot of fun following along with us. It's okay if your drawings don't look exactly like ours, because the most important thing is- To have fun. Yes, to have fun. And we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Yeah. Oh, you shoot a spider web? Yes, I shoot that too. <laughs> <laughs>